Brazil says a Chinese-made coronavirus vaccine will be part of its national immunization plan in one of the first such efforts in the world to fight the pandemic. The governor of the country's largest state, Sao Paulo, said they will buy 46 million doses of China's experimental Sinovac vaccine. João Doria said that he expects to be able to begin immunization in January next year. The fiancé of the murdered Saudi journalist Jamal Khashoggi has taken legal action in the United States against Saudi Arabia's Crown Prince Mohammed bin Salman. Hatija Cheng is and a human rights group are suing the prince and 28 other people for damages. The Saudis say the Crown Prince played no part in the killing. France's President Emmanuel Macron has announced a ban on an Islamist group he said was directly involved in beheading a teacher last week. He said the Sheikh Yassin Collective, named after the founder of the Palestinian militant group Hamas, would be outlawed on Wednesday. The teacher, Samuel Paty, was murdered after showing students a cartoon of the Prophet Muhammad. And the airline Cathay Pacific says it will cut nearly 6,000 jobs as it deals with the impact of the coronavirus pandemic. The Hong Kong-based company says further 2,600 roles that are currently unfilled will also be lost. Cathay is the latest major carrier in the Asia-Pacific region to announce drastic job cuts in recent weeks. There are reports that soldiers have opened fire on protesters in the Nigerian city of Lagos following more than a week of demonstrations calling for an end to alleged police brutality. Authorities have imposed an indefinite 24-hour curfew in response to the protests and a local governor has ordered an investigation into the shooting.